So the Rugby World Cup 2015 returns to the Millennium Stadium. Eight years after a shock Fijian win led to Warren Gatlin becoming Welsh coach. The sides meet again. The focus has to be full, said Lauren Gatlin this week. He knows that they have to do the job this afternoon. We go again, and these forwards sensing opportunity earlier on here around the fringe. No one to release the ball at the moment. Slowed down now. What a start from Gareth Davies. Will be a tiring game for the Welsh, especially if they're going backwards at a rate of knots like that. So impressive. Well, that's just how well the Fijians have sorted out their set piece. Pulls it, squeezes it inside the post and takes the three points. And that is a fine start from Fiji's young fly half. Kanatale struggling to pull his man down. Great hands from Bigger. Here's an opportunity. Tyler Morgan has his head over the line, but not the ball. Scott Baldwin does though. Home off. We need to check that. Baldwin says, yes, I've done it. That looks good enough for me. There is no reason why he can't award the try. Second try is given for Wales. It's lucky 13 for Scott Baldwin. Back to talk about it. again, showing that leg drive and power and pace. And the warning bells ringing in the Welsh camp right now as Fiji flood forward. The offload is there. Kanaba goes over. Started with this drop to Karatuma. It's the mismatch again in the front row. And the basketball skills just keeping patience. The silky running lines. And over. Captain Lee being what forced to stand up and the ball comes out. Kenatale. Well, great work from Palata. It looked like Kenatale had it. Coming off their feet that gives Dan Bigger this chance. Bigger's boot remains in perfect nick. Trying to make a difference now. Gareth Davis with his hands on the ball. Waiting for that little moment that he can snipe through. There's a Fijian hand underneath it. There's the hand underneath. That's incredible, D. Your try. Natami Talai take a bow and they now can look forward to their last game against Australia here in nine days time. What a performance from the Red Dragons.